This is Quentin Pooler. Here is the level I made to show uh, five different types of triggers. Um, first, there is the trigger that moves an object, uh, which will be right here. This door will move, and so does this one up here. Um, basically, I'm just going to show where they're at first and then play through the level. The next type is an object that moves that is not a door which is this platform right here when the player stands on it it will move across this rectangle over to the other platform uh, the next type is a trigger that uses enable input and key events to require key press and that is down here the control panel when the player is next to it, it will ask them to press E. Uh, and that also leads into the same type as the next trigger, which is requiring setting a boolean value from another object before becoming active, such as pressing E to unlock this door, or picking up the key inside of the, behind that door to unlock the one in the area above. Then there is text rendering in each of these little areas to help guide the player through the level as well as the one you could see earlier, the control panel. And lastly, um, if you walk up to the doors when they are still locked it will print locked up into the corner or when you pick the key up it'll tell you unlocked door number two but you cannot see that until I start to play the level which I will do right now so starting off here if you try to leave the starting area windows pop up with text uh, telling you to go to over to the control panel but to show the print string I will go over to the lock door first when you walk over to it it's very hard to see but it did print locked up in the corner um, let me back up and go over there again to try and get it um, and it does the same thing for the other doors and so if we go back over where we're supposed to go and go over the control panel it switched to saying press E so I'll do that and it tells me I unlock door number one which is this one walk over here go in it tells me to grab the key so I walk over there it says door two unlocked in the top left corner when I did that now I will walk up the stairs which it, if you didn't already pick up the key it tells you to do that first so going up the stairs getting on the platform takes you over to the other one which you cannot reach without jumping first and the walls around the key were also high enough that you couldn't jump over them which I'll show in a moment um, going across these boards to get to the final area where if you picked up the key this door will unlock and you walk in and you won and there's some giant gold nuggets in there to help signify that's what you're trying to get to now the last thing I'll show is that you were not able to jump over these walls like if I was on the outside I wouldn't be able to get through <laughs> same thing with down here if I tried to just jump over it it's too high to get that's about it for the uh, trigger assignment thank you for watching